everyone. Welcome back to a new episode of Mood with Jade. Today I am in Covent Garden, which is usually so loud and buzzing, but today I'm on a nice quiet street and it's stunning. I'm here to see Chapter House and I'm here to show you a penthouse apartment, duplex, two bedroom, like nothing I have ever seen before. And I'm very happy and excited to be able to bring this to my channel. So let's go into the foyer, go upstairs with you right to the top and show you everything that you need to see. So now I am inside the gorgeous entry reception area, which is where you'll have your post just over there to my left. It honestly reminds me of like a private members club feel. It's very luxurious without doing too much. Um, it's very rich and very cozy. I also love the lighting in here. So let's go up into the lifts just over here. Now imagine having a lift that takes you straight up to your own apartment. This is all yours this is all part of the penthouse that i'm showing you today and there are some beautiful gorgeous stairs you all know i'm obsessed with stairs on instagram but i will show you what's going on down there a little bit later there's also a great surprise that way but we're going to start off going this way into you know the main event the kitchen the living space the terraces everything is happening here as soon as you come into this gorgeous space you're greeted with a nice little sitting area I would call this a reading corner. Of course, you've got magazines such as some L decoration. The wood they've chosen over here is very inviting, very light and airy, and it just works really well with all the light pouring in. And you will notice that the whole apartment has windows and glass and sunlight everywhere, which is also why it's nice to have these trees. It's like bringing the outdoors inside. It just gives it such a nice, fresh and airy feel. So this is the first terrace, which leads off of the living space and also takes you into the office study area. So it's super long, amazing views. The sun is out for us today. It's showing up and showing out. Imagine having some outdoor furniture here. Actually, there's another one that has that already. So this one could just be for walking and talking on the phone. <laughs> you also have a Crestron system just here, which is where you can kind of control everything and you have some inbuilt storage here. So for those of you that are always looking for storage, it's hidden away. So right over here is the main area that really has made me really excited, to be honest with you. A green velvet sofa. You all know how I feel about green velvet. <laughs> I am someone that has more recently started to love colour in my home and I love that they've added so much different colours and textures throughout the apartment, just giving it a really nice feel. It's also really like vintage vibes, but also really modern. Of course, the outside of the building is in keeping with its history. It's super, super traditional, which is always such a nice mix, like this gorgeous stone coffee table. This is a dream right now, a dream. These accent chairs are beautiful. Oh, they swivel as well. Do they go all the way around? They go all the way around. I'm having a bit too much fun. Does it suit me? Yeah. Lovely, lovely vintage style cabinetry with lamps and this gorgeous, gorgeous piece of art, which is like a textile fabric it's beautiful but i love how they've tied everything in it's very warm very vintage and very unique this is not really the style you would tend to see you know in a penthouse a usual penthouse which is what makes it very special now back here is your social kitchen with the island you all know i love a good island and this kitchen is stunning because it's dark blacks you've got really dark tones here like the solid marble worktop the kitchen is actually from Dada and it's just beautiful. I mean, it speaks for itself. Everything is inbuilt. So there is your freezer nicely hidden away and it just looks amazing. You've got two ovens here. The sink is also stunning. I love how it just blends in perfectly with the worktop. So again, a gorgeous stone going on over here. And then just here, you actually have a wine fridge, which is always, always nice to have. And a lot of wine and champagne and all sorts can definitely definitely fit in there. Mila, extractor fan, even the glassware is a bit of jade. And then you have your bar stools here, perfect for socializing, as well as your dining table, which is beautiful. Even the chairs are stunning. They've really paid attention to detail in everything. I would like to host in here right now. So remember the second terrace that I mentioned, here it is. 
I'd say this one is a little bit more cooler to the other one, but this is perfect because it's just off the kitchen and dining space. So it's amazing for outdoor dining, outdoor hosting, and this one's a bit more wider as well. So more room to kind of move around and host. And you've got again, lovely city views and the sun shining. What more could you ask for? Let me know in the comments now, what do you guys think of the kitchen, the living space and the dining space? Because now I want to show you a little bit of a surprise hidden away behind all of the exciting stuff going on. You actually have this gorgeous mural back here, which is just beautiful, a curved wall. It just really feels unique. That's what I love about this apartment. The paint that has been used throughout the apartment is actually fire and ball. And I also want to point out the gorgeous oak chevron flooring which is beautiful it's stunning it speaks for itself but over here you actually have a utility room which is the size of many bedrooms if i'm being honest i'm trying to think what else i could put in here to utilize the space more because you know you have everything hidden and fitted nicely over there but then you still have some space to like move around and you also have gorgeous views of your own terrace <laughs> I love the layout of this space. I love that you can kind of walk around and then end up back here. So now we are back into your entryway where we had the lift, remember when I came up, and the stairs. Now just behind me, why, I can't even walk past this. Can you see this feature over here in your hallway? This is essentially a hallway. I haven't ever walked through a hallway just like this. So you've got some nice greenery and plants going on, which really brings the outdoors inside. And then over here, you have your study room. So now we're in the study, which is beautiful. I love that it's secluded as well from the social, comfortable areas in the apartment. It's just like a nice little addition to what's already been amazing. I love that they've placed the desk in the middle of the room because of course it means you can utilize the wall space. And doesn't that look amazing? Just over here, there's like another little section and I was just saying that this could actually become a bit of a bedroom study as well, or a guest room. So guests can actually sleep over and you're not using you know, the other bedrooms, which I'm yet to show you. The other addition to this space is that you actually have some doors that lead out to the terrace. Now this is the same terrace that goes all the way down into the living space. So tell me, what do you think of the study? Would you keep it as a study? Would you use it as a guest room? What would you do with it? I think it is great as a study because just over here, you actually have a shower room, bathroom, so you don't have to go into the kitchen and stuff while you're working or past the cozy zones to, you know, do what you need to do and it's separate from everything else. So they've mixed stone with a leather handle with glass and then you also have the oak staircase which is beautiful and it takes you all the way down here to like this private area of cozy lighting, dim, nothing too bright. Welcome to the pink room. I feel like I'm blending in in this room already. It's beautiful, it's very cozy, but you do have natural light that does come in because of course you have access to your own terrace over here, which is so nice. It's such a nice feature to have and it makes sense to have that in a penthouse. I think every room should have a bit of luxury, don't you think? So again, you have beautiful art features throughout the house. You also have spotlights in all of the rooms and you also do have a Sonos sound system throughout the apartment. So you can honestly have fun and enjoy life from every corner of the apartment. Inbuilt storage wardrobes here which are beautiful and you also have some more over here so your sport for choice in terms of where you want to put what is that one going to be your clothes is that one going to be your accessories it's up to you now through here you have your own ensuite bathroom and shower room because you have both so they've utilized the space really really well because they've managed to fit a really good bathtub which is beautiful and also a lovely glass shower with a rainfall shower head 
in there. So it really does give you the luxury feel that you are going to be paying for because of course it is an expensive price tag for a home like this. You also have a bit of a his and her type of feeling with the sink, a really large basin and then you've got two sections for each person and you have cabinetry where you can put all of your amazing skincare, beauty and all of that good stuff and everything's mirrored and cleanly designed. If you come just back here, I'm not taking you to the toilet, but I just want to point out the tiling here. It's like textured. It's really, really beautiful and just gives, you know, a bit of dimension. They've also got some Malin and Goat lovely products scattered around the apartment. They basically want me to move in. <laughs> And now we are in the blue room. Now the blue room is smaller than the pink room. So I would say this one, if you are maybe a young family, this might be the children's room or the not so important person's room if you're sharing with somebody else. But this room is still very nice. It still has lovely light coming in. It doesn't have access to the terrace, but it does have floor to almost ceiling windows, bringing in some lovely light. You also have some wardrobe space here. Oh, oh. Oh, they slide. <laughs> I thought I was pulling them out. They've also got lovely art going on just over here above the headboard. They've put everything in place for you to kind of have your TV up against this wall so everything is prepared and ready for you to go. And just around this corner, you have your shower room. So I'm clearly not dressed appropriately for the gym, but I had to come down here and show you that you do have access to this lovely gym, which is designed really well, but also has a lot going on in here. So there are weights, there are treadmills and everything that you can really have a good workout in. So just over on this side of the gym, you have got treadmills and you also have a row machine, mirror and it's very spacious. There's also a bathroom just there where you can obviously get changed, have a shower and that kind of thing. Go back up to your penthouse and relax. Now in the comments down below, let me know what you think about this amazing duplex apartment. Remember it's 5.5 million pounds. So would you pay that for this apartment? Also, can we get into the amazing design by L Decoration? I'm in love with it. Anyway, I'll see you all in the next move of Jade. Bye.